An object from outside our solar system is here right now. It's called 3i Atlas. And it's only the third confirmed interstellar visitor humanity has ever seen. After Oumuamua in 2017 and Borisov in 2019, 3i Atlas was discovered in July 2025. It's moving on a hyperbolic path, which means it's not from here and it's not staying. It's basically diving through our solar system once and then leaving forever. Current data suggests it behaves like an active comet. Ice, dust, gas, outgassing, nothing we've observed so far, proves it's a spacecraft. Right now, late October 2025, 3i Atlas is hitting perihelion. That's its closest approach to the Sun, around 1.36 AU, between Earth and Mars. At that point, it's moving tens of kilometers per second. That's normal for something falling deep into the Sun's gravity. Here's where the internet goes crazy. Some people think this object could fire engines during this close pass to change course using something called the Oberth effect. The physics is real. If you accelerate while you're near a massive body like the sun, you get a huge boost for the same fuel. But there is zero confirmed evidence that 3i Atlas has actually done any controlled burn, slowed down on purpose, or turned toward Earth. Observations so far still match a natural comet on a predictable pair. After swinging past the Sun, 3i Atlas will head back out and pass near Jupiter in March 2026, within tens of millions of kilometers. That's considered close, in deep space terms. This is where the sci-fi idea comes in. If an intelligent probe wanted to set up in our solar system, without dealing with 8 billion humans, Jupiter's moons are perfect. Moons like Ganymede, Europa, and Callisto, likely have massive water reserves under ice. Water means fuel, life support, and shielding. Jupiter also gives access to Trojan asteroids full of metals and minerals. That's why some people say, if aliens were colonizing, they'd go to Jupiter first, not Earth. Let's be clear. Based on current trajectory data, 3i Atlas does not pose an impact threat to Earth. The closest it gets to us is still extremely far around 1.8 AU in December 2025. That's almost twice the Earth-Sun distance. So here's where we really are. We are watching a piece of another star system slice through ours at insane speed. That alone is historic. We're learning what distant systems are made of in real time without sending a probe out for thousands of years. Is it aliens? Almost certainly not. Is it one of the rarest and most valuable scientific events we've ever witnessed? Yes. Follow for updates as we get new observations. This story is just getting started.